Well, good Friday morning to you folks. Looks like we made it um, to the beginning of the weekend um, in a few hours, anyhow. Second Timothy, Second Timothy chapter 4. The Apostle Paul, part of his charge to uh, Timothy, of course, uh, telling him to preach the word to be instant in season and out of season to reprove, rebuke, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine. But then in verse 6, we get to Paul's, uh, some of his final testimony here. He says, For I am now ready to be offered, and the time of my departure is at hand. I have fought a good fight. I have finished my course. I have kept the faith. Henceforth there is laid up for me a crown of righteousness which the Lord, the righteous judge, shall give me at that day. And not to me only, but unto all them also that love his appearing. There is laid up for me a crown of righteousness, which the Lord, the righteous judge, shall give me at that day. Not to me only, he says, but unto all them that love his appearing. I, uh, I was thinking, and, and I won't mention her name because I, I didn't ask the family, um, so I don't want to bring any harm there, I suppose. Um, but but there was a woman that, uh, if you go back and watch some of, uh, even on, on Facebook, if you go back and look at some of these posts, you will see down in the comments that there was a woman quite often saying, please pray for me. Uh, I have cancer. Please pray for me. I'm in pain. And, and my heart just went out to her. Um, I didn't know her well. But uh, but every time I would see that, I would stop whatever I was doing and I would pray for her. And uh, just a few days ago, my wife um, said uh, we were talking to uh, someone and she got a message from her family, my wife's family. And she said, oh, and I said, what's wrong? And she said, uh, the name of the woman, and she had passed away. It isn't just the Apostle Paul that gets that crown of righteousness. said the Lord, the righteous judge, would give him on that day. He said, but also to all them uh, who love his appearing. And so to those who have been forgiven of their sin, who have called out to him, not just to heal them or to help them with their pain or with their disease here, but folks, this isn't it. There is so much. Uh, it, the final day here is only the beginning of eternity. If you've been born again, then you have eternal life. If you have not been, you're holding on to... You're holding on to a dollar store piece of junk and God's trying to give you uh, a prize that's worth more than you could ever imagine. He's trying to give you eternal life, and here you are holding on to this petty life that will soon be over. I'm not saying we should be foolish with our health. I'm not saying that at all, but I'm saying if you choose to hang on to the world because you enjoy it so much. Look at everything that you miss out on. And especially when you leave this life. Well, we'll give this song a shot. It just made me think of that verse there. So <clears throat> we'll pray for um, for her family, of course. And for all those who um, are dealing with uh, situations today that we don't know what they are. You know, some days um, a good many people would watch this, some days not as many. Some days a good many people make comments, and I'm sure I've said before there are probably people that look and they just tap, they like it or whatever, and they probably don't even listen to it. You know, it's uh, not even 10 minutes long, but that's too much time uh, for somebody to listen to sometimes. So <laughs> it is what it is, right? But. Uh, Whatever the need is today, I pray that God blesses you and he touches you and, and he helps you. This may be our last day here, folks. This is a Friday the 13th. It may be our last day here. I don't care if it's uh, Friday the 30th, the 31st. It doesn't matter uh, about superstition. 
we may go to be with the Lord today. So. I lived a life that had no meaning All alone in a world without a friend Till Jesus gave me hope and inspiration And everlasting peace that lies within A crown of glory waits in heaven for those who bear His love inside Above the many things that I remember Is acceptance by my Savior, Lord and God The door of sin is always open For those who want to enter in but Christ holds the key to the only answer Just one truth and I know He'll let you in A crown of glory waits in heaven For those who bear His love inside Above the many things that I remember is acceptance by my Savior, Lord and God. I know my days down here are numbered, and time is swiftly drawing nigh. A burden so heavy has been lifted, Simple truth and understanding get me by. A crown of glory waits in heaven for those who bear His love inside. Above the many things that I remember is acceptance by my Savior, Lord and God. Is acceptance by my Savior, Lord and God. Lord, we thank you for the day you've given us, Lord, and I pray that you would watch over and bless for all those that watch this today, for whatever need it is that they have in their lives, Lord. Some may be younger, some may be older, um, God, but we're all, uh, all of us, human today we're all of us leaving here sometimes some sooner than others god we're so thankful that when we leave here i'm i'm not i'm not worried about a crown i'm not fretting over uh any uh rewards or awards that um can be gained and that is your business and you take care of it however you see fit but god i i just want to escape hell after serving you for years now, uh, I want to be able to fall at your feet. Anything that is offered for anything, for a crown of glory, a crown of righteousness, God, I want to be able to lay that at your feet for everything that you've done for us. We love you. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you, folks. I'll see you Saturday.